Imagine blowing the whistle 46 years ago because you were being sexually harassed on the job. This is 46 years ago. Uh, this happened to Sandra Bundy. You are truly a pioneer, and I mean, we absolutely applaud you for that. How did the harassment begin? They constantly berated me, constantly made me feel un... Just, 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 it's bad environment. It had to be hard for you to go to work every day. Well, why, why, why'd you stay on the job after the harassment? Well, I was a single parent with three children. I had to raise my children. And therefore, uh, I felt necessary to protect them and for myself. So what, what made you eventually blow the whistle? Because, I mean, you could lose your job. Right? Well, when I heard that several times, I just used the next procedure and um, I ignored it and said, it's, it's got to be a way. There's got to be a law. So I uh, proceeded uh, with the lawyers. And thank goodness these lawyers were, took my case, because they never had a case like mine. OK, now. Okay, now listen to this, folks. In her first case, the judge acknowledged that she was being harassed. The judge acknowledged that. But he ruled against you. Yes, that was the lower court of the District of Columbia. Um, he made a profound statement saying, well, boys will be boys. And he took it very lightly. So my but then, the, so the appeals court overturned his decision. Overturned his decision and um, ruled it against the lower court. And that's how I won my case. And, wow. <laughs> now, this 46 years ago, so just looking at the audience, the majority of you were not here oh, yeah. 46 years. The majority of this room was not here 46 years ago. And because of her case, it is now unlawful, her case, it is now unlawful under the Civil Rights Act to sexually harass someone in the workplace. This was her case. <laughs> do you feel vindicated? Uh, partially vindicated. Um, Why do you say partially? Because I was uh, subjected to more harassment after the case was settled. Um, they punished me severely until I retired. I was transferred for different positions, taken out of my position and been never placed back in my position. That was retaliation. So there's a law set also against retaliation after filing. I enjoyed my job because it, it uh, uh, I, I had a, a need for wanting to help people. And I always placed myself in the position, placed my children, if this happened to my children, how would I handle a situation like this? You know what, this, this is, you know, one person can make a difference. Yes. This woman made such a difference, it became a law. You know, and, and it's, it's, it's in place today. I'm, I'm, I'm happy to meet you because you... <laughs> you did it the right way. Yes. And I want to tell you something. You are really a true trailblazer and a warrior. You ought to be proud of yourself. Yes. You really should. And I know everybody in here agrees with that. Hey, I'm Steve Harvey. You want more of that? Well, don't just sit there. Go get it. Press subscribe or click on this list and you can see all the amazing videos you want. Press it. Press it.